Today at CRKT, we are taking a look at the Saker. This is an Abelius design. It's a bush crafting knife, a beautiful piece, and also highly functional. The overall length on it is 9.1 inches. The blade length is four and a half inches. It has a true Scandi grind right there. That's gonna be useful in the woods, getting bush crafting tasks done. Just a beautiful piece, well ground. You can see right here on the spine of the blade that is a right angle. So if you wanna throw sparks off of that with a uh, ferro rod, it's gonna be very useful for that. The handle scales are walnut, just a beautiful brown walnut. And they are riveted to the full tang blade, meaning that that uh, blade comes all the way, that piece of metal, piece of steel comes all the way to the end. You can see there's a lanyard hole there, and it is an oversized lanyard, so if you, you're going to be able to thread paracord through there, and uh, maybe even a small rope if you needed to, so a lot of things you can do there. It's very ergonomic in hand. That's one of the first things I noticed when I picked it up a few months ago. It just feels really nice in the hand. Uh, very ergonomic. You're not going to fatigue when you use it. It just feels solid. Feels like you can go out and get a lot of work done in the woods. Now it comes with a sheath as well. This is a leather sheath. Slides right in there. Beautiful leather, thick leather with an oversized uh, belt loop on it. Here's a shot of it on my belt just to get an idea of how it rides. Very nice. One last thing I want to tell you about this knife is it comes with a bushcrafting tool. Now this is kind of an Abelius design that comes with the, the bushcrafting knife. Basically what he told me is this is a tool to get bushcrafting tasks done. So you can use this uh, top grater portion to uh, use on a magnesium uh, fire steel magnesium rod to uh, get the magnesium off. You can use it for scraping like a tree branch to get finer feather sticks off of it. You can use this edge to throw sparks off a ferro rod. A lot of different things you can do here. Pull that way. And uh, so basically he just designed it as a tool to have in the woods and have accessible. One last thing I want to show you on this, which I thought was pretty cool. He designed this portion right in here, that hole to uh, work for arrow shafts for straightening arrows. So kind of a cool thing. And then he rounded those edges if you're uh, carving out the inside of a burnout bowl, that sort of thing. So it's really a bushcrafting tool designed for whatever you can imagine. So definitely a lot of things that you could do with this tool. And it comes with the Saker knife, which is pretty cool. Kind of have the whole bushcrafting package in one if you're getting into it, or if you're a veteran in that sort of niche, it's gonna be a great knife for you. It's gonna be a great survival knife for getting out in the woods, so. This is the Schrade SCHF51 Frontier Fixed Blade Bushcraft Survival Knife, one of two blades in the SCHF51 series. Stout, rugged, and equally capable in the backcountry as it is in the backyard. The SCHF51 is forged from tough, edge-retaining 1095 high-carbon steel. The thick, full-tang blade spine drops to form a sturdy tip, suitable for drilling, piercing, and a wide range of fine cutting tests. The blade is coated in scratch and corrosion resistant PTFE that reduces friction during batoning, feathering, and other bushcraft tasks. The razor sharp five inch blade terminates at the generous choil for sharpening of the entire fine edge and careful finger placement for precision cutting tasks that require a high degree of control. Contoured non-slip TPE handle scales reduce vibration and hot spots while ensuring a secure grip in all weather conditions. Grip and leverage are enhanced by thumb jimping on the spine side of the grip. The solid pommel is suitable for hammering and crushing, while the lanyard hole allows you to add cordage for additional security. The sheath is made from durable, water and mildew resistant woven fabric and includes a polymer inner sheath, adjustable handle strap, leg lanyard and belt loop. Open the front sheath pouch to reveal a four inch diamond sharpener and a two and a half inch ferrule rod with striker. Ready for bushcraft and a wide range of utility tasks, crafted from premium materials and built for a lifetime. The EXF01 is a precision built high performance powerhouse that effortlessly fits the role of a tactical or survival tool where durability is paramount. 
It was designed by former Marine Recon and renowned custom knife maker Alan Aleshowitz and is proudly made in the USA by Hogan Incorporated. It is available in two sizes, a 5.5 or 7 inch blade. The full tank construction is made from A2 tool steel and comes in a heavy duty drop point with a flat grind. Each knife is honed by hand and cryogenically heat treated for exceptional cutting performance. All of the models feature an abrasion and corrosion resistant kiln baked Cerakote firearms finish. Colors are matched with the handle scales for a low key visual footprint. The scales come in our patented Jamascus G10 composite and Cocobolo hardwood. Holes in the end of the handle and base of the blade allow for multiple lashing points or the addition of a lanyard. Jamascus G10 models come with a Torx tool that allows you to stow small items in the spaces of the skeletonized handle beneath the scales. The handle is fully sculpted for exceptional ergonomics and features a pointed pommel that can be used as an impact tool. The intelligently designed sheath features webbing on the front and back allowing for belt carry or attachment to Molly compatible systems. Made from ballistic nylon with a polymer insert, it is built to last and can be expanded on with our optional Molly pouches. A length of paracord is included. Elegant yet tough, the EXF-01 has been designed to easily overcome demanding tasks with reliability and ease. Hi, I'm Mark McLean with Buck Knives. I'm the design supervisor here, and one of the knives that we introduced this year at SHOT Show is the 863 Selkirk. This is a mid-sized knife that has great features and allows you to use it in rugged conditions. One of the key things of any knife of this size is that it has a 4 and 5 eighths inch blade. The overall weight is 7.6 ounces. The blade is full tank construction all the way through. It features a solid guard up front and a pommel strike uh, surface on the back to use as a hammer in light, weight, light duty conditions. The blade is 420 high carbon, flat ground, and a drop point blade. It has jimping at the at the near the handle for good control. Um, and then with any fixed blade knife, a key part of, of how that knife is used is how it's carried. So we've created a, a plastic molded sheath system that allows you to snap it into place. And along with this sheath, one of the added features is a striker whistle component that allows you to create a spark and also to signal in case of an emergency or to gather other people in your group together. So this works with, in combination with the knife to create sparks. So we've put a notch on the bottom of the blade instead of the back where you would put your thumb. And we don't necessarily want you using the edge of your blade because that would dull it for the uses that you need. So we've got this little notch that's sharp there and it will spark and create the sparks you need to light your tinder and get a fire going. So with this sheath, we can put our striker and whistle back in and our knife back together. And so we've created it so that you can carry it in lots of different positions. Some people like carrying it high on their waist, some people like carrying it a little bit lower. And it's set up, this one is set up for vertical carry, so we've got a belt loop here. And we also incorporated an, another feature on this belt loop. People have different size belts. And so to prevent the sheath from sliding up and down when you're pulling the blade out, we've got a spacer in here and, and it can go in one of three positions. So if you have a very narrow belt, you can use it, or if you have a wide belt, you can take it out. This one is set up for horizontal carry. And so it's a matter of unmounting those components and rearranging them and putting them into the configuration that best suits you. I've even seen somebody take this and set it so that it works at an angle. So if you like to do things in a cross-draw situation at a slight angle, it can be configured that way as well. This is the Schrade SCHF-59 Full Tang Fixed Blade Knife. Built full tang tough and forged from a single slab of 65mn high carbon steel, the SCHF-59 is designed to take on the toughest bushcraft and camping chores. Whether batoning or making feather sticks, the SCHF-59 boasts top-notch edge retention, ensuring that you never lose your edge. Weighing just over 6 ounces, the SCHF-59 features a 4-inch long drop-point blade that is razor-sharp 
and big enough to handle a variety of bushcraft tasks without weighing you down. A 2.5-inch topside false edge enhances penetration power when piercing or using the SCHF-59 for drilling tasks, such as tapping trees for water. Textured G10 handle slabs give the SCHF-59 a slim profile and allow for a comfortable full grip regardless of weather conditions. The spine of the blade features thumb rest jimping to furthermore enhance grip during power cuts while promoting all-day blister-free use. An ergonomic finger guard keeps fingers well behind the blade. The SCHF-59 arrives seriously sharp in a black thermoplastic belt sheath featuring an oversized belt loop that attaches to any size belt and includes a quality ferrule rod guaranteeing that you'll have a campfire wherever your adventures may take you. Ready for adventure, crafted from premium materials and built for a lifetime. This is the Schrade SCHF-59 Full Tang Fixed Blade Knife. Our sturdy full tank knife Garberg is a real bushcraft tool. Hardened and treated in our factory in Mora to be even stronger. The cut is razor sharp from the start and Garberg is easy to sharpen in the outdoors thanks to the scanning grind profile. Garberg is one of my very favorite knives. Simply because it's extremely strong. Many times in the wilderness you need a reliable knife and Garbay has all those features. The grip is very good and solid even when it's wet. The full tang steel is very strong. For example, chopping woods, building shelters and in the end making a fire. Garber comes with a flexible multi-mount holder to be placed wherever you want. Or accompanied by an exclusive black leather sheet, which will become more beautiful the more you use your knife. When I need an extremely strong knife, Garber is definitely my first choice. The Selgram knife it is a thick and strong bushcraft and survival knife. It is designed with this thick blade so you can uh, practice batoning and chopping easily. Also it has a border socket for primitive fire and also this notch for a ferrocerium rod striking. Beside you have this coconut breaker so you can give him some uh, hard thing to do like uh, breaking stuff or precision wood. Fingertip for a better grip and a nice large condor edge. It is a convex edge. 